Yo guys, what's going on? It's Justin Miller here with another tutorial coming. Oh my god, I forgot to plug in my mic. What's going on guys? Justin Miller here with another tutorial coming at you because today is Friday and on Fridays I do tutorials on my channel if you guys are new here. Consider clicking that subscribe button. So today I actually got a couple of questions in the last video. The cinematic challenge video, so I'll put them up on screen here. So the question was, can you make a tutorial on how you do the zoom transition and and the wiggle? So if you guys don't know, it is the shake transition where, you know, it zooms out and shakes a little bit. I'll put in a clip right here. So pretty much all I have to do is I'm actually going to give you guys the preset on how I did this. All you have to do is just um, go into your preset tab under the effects tab and right click and click import preset and then select the preset, my preset that you want. Um, but I'll link that down below so you guys can download it because that'll save you just a lot of time. And the other quick question was, how do you crop a video and hit film? So there's two different ways you can crop a video and hit film. One of the ways you just set the scale and position and zoom in and set the position. That's one way to do it. Or there's another way, which would be to mask the image that you want to crop if you want it cropped in a certain way, if you just want a small image. So all you have to do is click the rectangular mask in the left sidebar and then select the parts that you want to be masked out and that's how you crop the video as well. So hopefully these quick questions in this tutorial was helpful for you guys. Like I said, the zoom wiggle shake transition will be in the description below. So um, uh, click on that you guys can get the transition too. And if you guys um, use those in any of your clips, be sure to send them to me. Send them my way on Instagram. I'll put my Instagram right there because I actually want to see them because I'm sure you guys are probably pretty cool and I want to see your work. So um, thank you guys for watching this video. Make sure that you guys drop a comment down below for what tutorial you want to see next time because I can teach you all kinds of stuff. Like the video and subscribe if you guys haven't already because I post new videos every Monday and Friday. And I'll see you guys next time.